you get confronted by it. And I was very keen to explore all these materials because they all have a different energy. So I've worked with concrete, with copper, with brass, with aluminium, also very much uh, with textiles. But combining those more softer materials with, with the more harsher materials like aluminium, it brings something to the fore that is quite profound. In my recent series, um, which is called Elemental Formations, I was determined to have a very concise body of work. They all had to relate to each other in a certain way. Here, I've worked with brass, aluminium and acrylic. Uh, I never worked with acrylic before and it's uh, not an easy thing. It's hard to drill, it's hard to cut, but I was determined to make it work because acrylic has a beautiful kind of a vulnerability, uh, very much like glass. Aluminium is obviously a very contemporary material and while I like to work in a, in a contemporary way, it is very much about things and history that has gone on before. Uh, the grid-like structure with the, the little screws, I mean, it's, it's just small detailing, but it's, it's very important because it makes that the work has a different kind of presence. I didn't want my work to be too sterile, too just about the now. I've spent three years at Corbin's Art Centre, which was a wonderful experience, uh, working with other artists from all sorts of different backgrounds, using all sorts of media. It opened me up to, to lots of different ways of working and, and just a great experience.